Hi folks, Clyde Lindsay here from Pixel Pro Displays. Thanks for joining me on this Twinkle Tips Friday. I wanna get this out because this is interesting and it's something a lot of people don't think about anymore. Okay, let's go ahead and get started in this. Uh, what you see here, we got a little star here and then we got a little mini tree. So most people, whenever they wanna go pick up a mini tree, what they'll do is they'll go and pick up uh, something from, uh, let's say, Boscoyo Studios. You've got some NSR trees from uh, EFL Designs. Gilbert Engineering has mini trees as well. Uh, you know, and there's varieties. They come in different shapes and sizes. But what about making the model for these? So we're so spoiled in this hobby that our, our vendors are great. They, they make our models for us and we can easily down them, download them. But what if, what if you realize that x -Lights already has a model for a mini tree and it's in the form of a big tree? So x -Lights has this model right here. You can create a mini tree out of a big tree. You just have to know exactly how the tree is set up and built. In this example of a mini tree, you've got a, it's 17 tall by five wide. Let's go ahead and plug that in there. Uh, let's put uh, one string, one string, and we have nodes per string. Well, we have 15 or 17. Oh, let's do some simple math here. Cause you know, with, with 17 times five, you got 85 pixels total. So we'll go ahead and we'll put nodes per string at 85 and we have five bends in the string. It's, so that's our tree right there, but we got to fix it here because this is only a 180 degree tree. There we go. And that is the exact model of the mega of the mini tree that this one is right here. Now there's different ways that you can wire it. I set this up so that it would start at the bottom left, which in, in the tree here, it's the bottom left here. It's going to go up and down, up, down, and up. Now, whenever you have an odd number of strands, look what happens if you go, if you, if you run from the bottom up, you end up at the top and you know, now you can fill in the pixels around the star. So now you can go in and you can create your star model just as easily. And it doesn't matter how you wire it. You can just come in here. It's 20 pixels. And if you come over here, strings or strands or number of nodes per strand, it's 20 pixels. That's what's on it. And there you go. There is your mini tree and your mini tree star. And if you wire it the way here, we'll, we'll look at the wiring diagram, wiring view. If you look at the wiring view, you can see you can go up, down, up, down, and up, and you end up at the top here. That's 85. And then you can go all the way around the top of the tree there and um, uh, get the star at the top of the tree. And that's everything I have for you today, guys. Thank you for joining us here at Pixel Pro Displays. If you like the video, give us a big thumbs up. If you haven't done yet, so hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the bell for notifications because we've got a lot of things coming down the pipe. And with your suggestions, there might be a couple things that we might add in that we might not have thought of. Our goal is to save you some time and frustration and some energy whenever it comes to building your show and making things work in, in your layout and getting you going. So. If you do have questions or if you're challenged by some of the things that are in X-Lights, consider giving the pros a call. We offer the services of building layouts, setting up your groups, creating things for you so that you can just focus on what you enjoy doing, which might be the build, which might be the, the put together and then getting all the pixels and everything. So consider letting Pixel Pro Displays take your show layout to the next level. Thanks for watching, guys. We will see you in the next video. Take care.